All right, so we made it through the night. Sorry if I got that look. Um, just woke up probably about an hour ago. Um, but no bears. No bears came and visited us last night, which was good. Um, the funny thing is, is me and Ryan were talking. There, We didn't see any animal life. We didn't see any squirrels. We didn't see nothing. We don't hear anything up here. Um, we heard a couple birds yesterday. That was just about it. But for being one of the most biodiverse hotspots in the country, uh, the Appalachian Mountains, and especially this area right in here, um, Western Carolina, we didn't really see much diversity unless it's just plants and bugs and stuff like that. And I did see a salamander, though. I did see a salamander. But, um, yeah, this is one thing. The moisture up here, the dew this morning... I'll show you my little machete. Yeah, I was sleeping next to my machete, just in case. But look at that puddle of water right there. My whole sleeping bag is soaked. Um, this is all soaked. But when the dew came this morning, it just it soaked everything, man. And if I had a, the fly over this, it probably would have stopped that. But, but yeah, there's the view. And you can kind of see over in town... There's like some fog in the mountains. A little bit. Let's see if I can zoom in a little. So it was pretty cool. So how was it, Ryan, sleeping in the hammock? That was great. Yeah. Yeah, I think it opened up a whole, whole new, um, whole new uh, future for me. Can't I'm do hammock quite often now. Hammock camping. Yeah, good to go. And uh, he was showing me this, and this strap right here is this long, the one that goes to the tree. So if that tree's a little bit farther away, you can just put it on another little notch. Or if you want it tighter, you know, you might not be able to get up to that one, but, you know, you can loosen up that one and get to it, so, it's quick. You, you can hang this hammock in about two minutes. That's awesome. It's called an Eno, and uh, I heard that these are made actually up here in the, in the mountains by a company outside of Asheville or something like that, right? I think so. I don't know. But yeah nice old hammock so that's pretty cool but um <clears throat> we're gonna probably start heading down the mountain here pretty soon and uh i'm thinking it's probably it took us four hours to get up and we we took what was it four miles we found out it was yeah, like four and a half four and a half so that was like a mile an hour so we're gonna hopefully get down there a little bit faster than that going downhill but um we went up pretty high man we went up how many thousands of feet? How how high is 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 town where we're at? Um, we we probably gained thirty five hundred feet. Thirty five hundred feet. So that's pretty cool. Not bad. And now we're about ready to leave, and now the sun finally starts to come out. Oh yeah. <clears throat> well, I didn't get to show you guys a lot of my gear that I had. I had to leave a lot of it on the trail coming up here because I brought way too much crap. Stuff I really didn't even need and uh yeah, I brought way too much stuff. An extra blanket, some extra clothes, um an extra thing of Gatorade. Yeah, I just left it up there cuz it was it was way too much coming up here. But uh but yeah, we're going to start heading down here pretty soon. It was pretty fun. So, maybe we'll do some more videos here before we get down the mountain. All right. We just noticed this as we were leaving camp, but this is the trail going right to the, the burn pit right there, and less than less than a hundred feet from our camp is, bur, uh, is uh, bear poop. We got bear shit right here. So yeah, that's a good sign, huh? <laughs> Right here. The other trail comes out from over here. Oh, the one that goes down the backside by yeah. by your place. All right. Yeah, these little holes I was talking about. These little depressions. 
No, I'm standing on like, one right now. Like right here. And then, oh yeah. You can just kind of lay in there. It's like a soft couch. A little support. Yeah. You could put your tent right on top of that. Yeah. Probably, right? Down. <laughs>